A look at the site as the week began revealed a great deal of steel and considerable activity on the west section of the north wall. The number of people involved hint at the complexity of the task. There are large, heavy wall forms to move and a host of smaller sections to install correctly and well. And the installation of reinforcing rod has to be phased into the whole business. With a host of other details, the iron workers of Structur de Bos were very busy too. They weave in and out of the steel structure with considerable skill. With the main structural build paused, there was time to work on positioning the roof panels. Maintenance of fall protection is a key ingredient of work at height. After last week's heavy rains, it was no surprise to see GFL pumping out some of the collection tanks. Excavation activity in the northwest corner was a little more unusual, but we'll hear more about that later. Tuesday saw work continue to prepare the wall forms for eventual concrete pour. The iron workers continued to place roof panels and I want you to pay close attention to how they finish with each panel. Note that a mark is made to correspond to the underlying beam. This is where it will eventually be attached. The environmental team were busy too bringing in sand, relocating gravel, and generally keeping occupied. There was also an opportunity Make up some old foundations. And the front loader came in handy for removing spoil from that strange excavation in the northwest corner. Wednesday kicked off with very similar activity from environmental. And work continued on the north wall. Back on the roof, the gun that fastens the roof panels needed some minor attention. There was also preparation for, and some actual welding of joints. And the steel sections don't position themselves. Everything works out and ties in in the end. Back in the northwest corner, a look up from the wall reveals an interesting new trench. 
its proximity to the power distribution box suggests that it's home to a hydro cable powering the site. We'll leave Wednesday with a final look at building the north wall west section. These images give you a pretty good idea of conditions that prevailed throughout much of Thursday. But the wall forms and the walkway associated with them and all the other features are coming together. Things were looking good as we headed into Friday. Work on Friday again concentrated on completing the west section of the north wall. It involves an awful lot of detail-oriented work and it's a much more complex task than people might imagine. Rain had threatened all day and as it finally arrived we discovered the purpose of the mystery excavation. It's a vault that from its appearance looks likely to serve as a junction point for various cable runs. And with the arrival of the rain that's where we'll leave the Kingston Centre this week. I hope you'll join me for next week's update. And in the meantime, thanks for watching.